Welcome to the Late Night Review Show. My name is Katie and this week I will be reviewing the Phillies Q102 Jingle Ball concert at the Wells Fargo Center. I am Leilani and tonight I will be reviewing a show called Gossip Girl. This past Wednesday I went to Jingle Ball which featured Selena Gomez, Shawn Mendes and many more. The beginning of the show started late, which was expected, but the opening act was Five Seconds of Summer. Now, personally, I don't enjoy Five Seconds of Summer, but even without my biased opinion, their performance was weak and they didn't stand out for me. The only other performance that was disappointing was Shawn Mendes. He was not moving around during his performance and only sang one or two songs that are already overplayed on the radio. The acts that stood out to me the most would have to be Alicia Cara and Tevlo. Although Alicia Cara's music was really enjoyable, she is way uglier in person than she is in pictures. She performed some of her most well-known songs and her voice is angelic. It gave me chills. First thing I have to say about Tev Lowe is that she definitely used autotune, but she was able to make it work. Overall, it was a fun and exciting show, even though there are aspects that could have been changed to make it better. Gossip Girl was a phenomenal drama series that concluded in 2012. The Enchanting Show was based in the Upper East Side in Manhattan, New York. The show doesn't just include typical teenage drama, but interesting plots and twists that leave you on the edge of your seat. All the characters on the show may seem alien to a typical person like you and me because of the fact that they are incredibly wealthy and live a rich lifestyle that differs from an average Joe's. However, the show makes all of the cast somewhat similar to you and I so that the show is more relatable. The show includes six main characters that goes by the name of Chuck Bass, Blair Waldorf, Serena Vanderwoodson, Dan Humphrey, Vanessa Abrams, and Nate Archibald. The series efficiently follows all of the characters through their endeavors. You have the heart-wrenching love story that includes Chuck and Blair. A viewer gets to watch all their crazy ups and downs. Also, you get to see Dan Humphrey's point of view as an outcast. He was not nearly as wealthy as the rest of the cast and was constantly perceived as a lonely boy because of the fact that no one wanted anything to do with him. Vanessa Abrams' character is similar to Dan's in the fact that she is labeled as an outcast and is in within, within the same social class as Dan. Serena Vanderwoodson plays a major role in the series as she is labeled the it girl and has everything and everyone at the palm of her hand. She goes through intense dramatic relationships that has you intrigued every second of the show. Lastly, we have Nate Archibald, a young businessman who faces a predictable problem. He battles balancing love and work and has to decide for himself which is more important. Overall, Gossip Girl was an amazing show fit for any teen who's into a dramatic series. That concludes the Late Night Review Show. Thank you for watching and tune in next week for another round of reviews.